In this Malaysia vlog, we're having a beach vacation on the Malaysia East Coast. We're traveling from Pekan to the city of Kuantan and staying at the Timor Bay residences at Balok Beach. Hi, I'm Jay. And I'm John. And we're Bucket List Travelers. And we're coming to you from Kuantan, Malaysia. We're just on the outskirts of Pekan, just maybe a five minute walk from the Ankasa Hotel. So we're just waiting for the mass transit bus, the 400, to take us to Kuantan. So apparently it's every half hour and it should only be a couple of ring at each. So we've just got here. Hopefully it comes pretty soon. One important thing to know about the Rapid Quantan bus service is that you need to have the exact fare when you're paying the bus driver as they don't give change. Once in Quantan, we hopped on the 600 Rapid Quantan bus and 30 minutes later we arrived at our destination, Timor Bay on Pantai Balok. So here we are at Timor Bay Apartments in Quantum. So it's about 15 kilometers, 12, 15 kilometers away from the main city area of Quantum on the beach. And it's a big sprawling complex with a really big pool. It's a little bit busy right now, so we're going to go to the beach instead, which is just over here. So convenient. Now we're heading out onto the beach and you can hire your own ATV just through here. So I believe it's around 50 ringgit for half an hour. So it seems to be pretty popular. I'm sure we'll see some ATVs zoom past quite soon. And it looks like there's person parasailing out there. That's pretty cool too. So yeah, people tend to use the pool more than the beach. So it suits us fine because we have the beach all to ourselves. It's just sprawling. It's really nice. The water's really nice as well. It's like a nice, comfortable soup. So it's probably around, I don't know, 30 degrees Celsius, 90 degrees Fahrenheit-ish. Yeah, it's really nice and you just don't want to get out. sand here you've got these intricate patterns in the sand so there's all these tiny little crabs on the beach that have been very busy digging their little holes and balling up the sand all along here and as you walk along you see them scurry back into their holes it's really cute what I'm finding interesting about today it's Friday afternoon and there's a whole section that's just been cordoned off by witches hats which is quite handy because the ATVs just zoom right past so it can get a little bit dangerous so I'm wondering whether they're just preparing for the weekend so this whole week it's been very quiet on the beach maybe it's different on the weekend we're going to find out very shortly uh, so nice and warm in the water this is my favourite part of the day you know how I was saying there weren't many people on the beach well half an hour later and there are plenty of people on the beach so it seems like 6 p.m. at night's the time to get down to the beach. So we're a little bit early at 5.30. Welcome to our Airbnb in Timor Bay, Kuantan, Malaysia. We're in an apartment that's right on the beach. We've got a balcony which has views of the car park and the surrounding area. It does have hanging space, which is quite nice. It's a one bedroom apartment with a really large open area, but it's been separated by this bookshelf here. So you've got a main bed here. You've also got a single bed if you want a third person. It's got plenty of storage space, which we like. And then it's got a really nice kitchen, washing machine. There's the water filter here, which is really cool. So in Malaysia, you can't drink the tap water. So it's just extremely handy to have this filter. It does cold and hot water. Awesome. Yeah, that's been really handy. So we've also got a very nice bathroom here. It's got both an, a waterfall shower as well as the normal shower head. So that's been quite good. 
The apartment's really nicely renovated, or it's really nice and modern, seems pretty new. There are a lot of rental companies that are um, putting up uh, apartments for rent in this complex. It's quite a big complex. You can look on Airbnb or you can look at the various holiday rental apartment providers. So there's a lot of options for you. So it seems to be a very popular holiday spot. So you've also got another bedroom here, which is quite nice. The TV has Netflix, which we really enjoy. So it's a really comfortable seating area. You will find when you're looking at apartments in the Timor Bay complex that the layout's pretty much identical. So you'll have this same divider cupboard that separates the living room from the bedrooms. The only thing that differs between the apartments is whether you're looking at the car park or looking at the beach. Now for us, we don't really care if we're not looking at the beach because all we need to do is just walk down the stairs and there's the beach. So we paid around 40 US dollars per night for this room. So it's not, you know, in terms of Malaysia, it's not cheap, but it's not too expensive. So it's, it's okay. And you will find that that was pretty competitive and the prices go up from there depending on whether you've got the sea views. There are plenty of restaurants to choose from around Tamal Bay. Two places we tried out were My Sate, a local Malaysian restaurant, and Chicken Plus Honey, which is a Korean style fried chicken restaurant. This is a strawberry float. So it looks like it's a strawberry soda or a strawberry drink, and then it's topped with vanilla ice cream. So, oh, this looks so good. Oh, yeah. Really refreshing. And I love ice cream, so this is the perfect drink. This is Nazi and Pit I Am. So this is chicken and rice cakes and a delicious sauce. And it's got some cucumber and onion in there as well. Really good. You can't visit a satay restaurant without trying the satay sticks. The combination of the peanut, sweet and spicy flavours makes this one of my favourite Malaysian street foods. We're at Honey Chicken, which is a Korean chicken shop in Malaysia. And we've got a six piece set. So it comes with six pieces of chicken, fries and drink, all for 18 ringgit. We've got the garlic soy chicken, so it's like a honey, garlicky goodness. So they make it fresh for you. So it took about 10 minutes to come out, but it looks glistening and great. Yeah, that's good. So it's sweet and it's a little bit garlicky, but it's really sweet. It's really crunchy on the outside and then the the chicken on the inside is really tender and juicy, it's really good. We hope you enjoyed our Kwantan East Coast Malaysia vlog. If you did, hit that like button and let us know what you thought by leaving us a comment. We've got plenty more Malaysia travel videos on the way, so make sure you subscribe and hit that notification button to stay tuned.